It's that time again, guys, where we get the week challenges ahead of time. And the leak is out, guys. We get the week seven leak challenges. And here's what you will need to do in order to complete every single challenge. But before we get started, I do want to know how you guys are enjoying the week six challenges. Were you able to complete them all? And if you haven't complete them all, definitely check out any of the videos that are showing up on the card or in the description down below to help you actually complete this. If you need help getting the supply drops, definitely check out that video. If you also need help finding the battle star, the hidden battle star, or all the posters, definitely check out those videos to help you guys out and complete all your challenges. But this week, Savage challenges seem pretty interesting, and we're going to dive right into them and find out exactly what they are. Starting off with the first one, you're going to want to deal damage with a pickaxe, and this is not going to be like a one out of three. This is actually, uh, you need to deal 250 damage. Now remember, every time you hit someone with a pickaxe, it's 10. So you're going to be doing a lot of damage. You're going to be needing to hit people with the pickaxe a lot. So best tip I could give you for this particular challenge is definitely down someone first and then pickaxe them to death. That would be the fastest way to complete this challenge. And you guys should be able to get this done fairly, fairly quickly. The next challenge we have is search chest in risky reels. Now, if you guys haven't been to risky reels, then it's definitely something you guys are going to want to know. Because you're going to want to know exactly what chests you're going to need to get in order to get those chests. You're going to have to find those chests in Risky Reel. And there is quite a lot of chests and a lot of people don't even know exactly where they're at. So if you guys would like to see a video on where all the chests are in Risky Reel, do me two favors. One, let's try to get this video to 100 likes. And number two, drop in the comment section down below, hashtag Risky Reels. And we'll definitely put out that video for you guys so you guys know exactly where to find the chest and I can also give you guys a little cheat cheat on what chest to pick up so you guys won't have to get killed every time you go and pick one up. The next one we have is one called Consume Forged Items. Now this Consume Forged Items seems really really interesting because we've never seen that anywhere applied in the game and what I believe the fo Consume Forged Items are going to be the apples and the mushrooms. Now these are going to be interesting because if you guys don't know exactly where the apple locations are at, you're definitely going to want to check out my video where I go and detail exactly where to find apples, where's the best way to get them, and also where to find them so you guys don't have to be looking around the map to find them. And I also have a all mushroom location video so you guys want to check that out so you guys know exactly where they're at beforehand. Definitely do check out the video so you guys know exactly where to find the mushrooms and the apples. And the next one we have is actually quite a funny one and an interesting one because we have score a goal on different pitches. Now, if you guys don't know where all the pitches locations are at, there are a couple within the game and not everybody knows where they're at. It's kind of funny because there are multiple more than one. Everybody kind of just knows one. But if you guys don't know exactly where they're at, I'll definitely have a video guys showing you exactly where all the uh, all the goal location or all the pitching goal locations are at. This is kind of tying into the World Cup being released pretty soon. And this is going hand in hand with the World Cup event. Now onto the hard challenges guys. We have follow the treasure map found in dot dot dot. Now this is kind of interesting because I don't know if they're actually doing this in order for us not to be able to know where the map location is beforehand. Or if it's something that we kind of kind of have to decrypt and find out exactly where, where it's at but you guys don't have to worry about that because i will have you guys completely covered on where this treasure map is i'm already doing a little bit of investigation trying to figure out exactly where this map is and once i have it sorted out i'll definitely put that video up there so make sure you guys subscribe to the channel turn on your notifications so you guys know exactly when that video goes live the next one that i don't really consider to be too hard is assault rifle eliminations is basically you have to eliminate five opponents with the assault rifle this was actually pretty easy and i'm pretty sure the majority of you guys should be able to knock this out without a problem super easy one i don't know why it's listed and hard maybe they could have put you know like search of chest on hard or the consume forge items on hard or maybe score a goal and the pitches is hard but i don't i don't really consider this one to be a hard one this is pretty easy one and you guys should be able to get this done like either in one complete match or in two to three matches. And the last hard one that we have, guys, is eliminate opponents in Shifty Shaft. Now, this is quite a funny one because Shifty Shaft is a very small area. It's not that it's not very big. And it's gonna be kind of kind of really hectic when we land there because usually anytime that we land into these locations, there's usually like a bigger space. It's not that such a constrained space. And knowing that this is gonna be in Shifty Shafts is gonna make it quite interesting because we're gonna have to eliminate opponents. The good thing is we only have to eliminate zero out of three. And there you guys have it. Those are all the challenges for week seven. Let me know in the comment section below if you think they're hard or if they're easy with the hashtag hard or hashtag easy in the comment section down below. I will be at E3 all this week. So if you guys have any questions regarding any new games that are coming out or any of that information, 
Drop it out in the comment section down below. We'll try to answer that. We're going to be covering a little bit of stuff, new stuff that's coming into Fortnite as well. So I can't really say a lot of things that I already know, but you guys are definitely going to want to stay tuned to the channel to find out exactly what those are. Don't forget to check out any of the Fortnite videos that I have showing up on the stream. They're going to be helping you with the week six and the week seven as well. And don't forget, guys, for all things Fortnite, make sure you guys keep it locked on this channel, and I will catch you guys on the next video.